All right, we're back once again with another mystery box. This time it's from our friends at sellbackyourbook.com. I don't know. I bought it off of eBay. So uh, why don't we open it up and see what's inside? Let's get started. All right, so as you probably already saw in the description, we got another mystery box here. This time it's a random assortment of 100 CDs. Uh, this was, I'll put a link if it's still available. They had a bunch of these. I'll put a link in the description below. Uh, I, like I said, I just got it off of eBay. So I'll put the link down in the description. It was pretty cheap. It was under $30. So I think it ended up being like 27 or 29 cents. I don't know, something like that uh, per CD. It was like $29. And that was including shipping on there. They ship it out media mail, but still. And this thing weighs a ton, but I suppose you would imagine it would weigh a ton if it's filled with CDs. But uh, I just thought, why not? Give it a shot. See what, what you get. Um, the CDs over at Goodwill are like 48 cents a piece. So these are even cheaper than that, but um, probably going to be nothing but a bunch of garbage, but uh, maybe we'll be surprised. So why don't we go ahead and get it opened up here? Got the old trusty knife. And you can tell it weighs a lot. The tape is already broken on the one side. This side's intact though. I can only imagine once I open up, half the jewel cases are probably going to be cracked or shattered or whatever, too. We'll see if it made it all in one piece. So, all right. And there's lots of paper. So why don't we just start grabbing some of these out of here. This one is Multi-Tracks Indoor Cycling. I have no idea. I guess it's music to cycle by. All right. And then the Disney Wizards of Waverly Place soundtrack. Interesting. I should look and see if these are in, what kind of shape these are in. Oh, it's not bad. Big old fingerprint smudge on there, but that's it. Next Generation Swing, Volume 2. Okay. I'll probably go quick on some of these. VH1 Divas Live. So far, all of them seem like they got the CD in there. Nothing really that memorable. Jermaine Dupri presents Life in 1472, the original soundtrack. Jill Hennessy, Ghost in My Head. Okay. Tapestries Classical, the classics. Mariah Carey, Daydream. Pretty beat up case. See, he's kind of scratched up. And the insert is all... broken but all right dj club mix volume five i spy junior <laughs> piece together I don't know that one. Paul Brandt, Outside the Frame. That's a country one, I know. I've heard that guy before. Great Broadway show tunes. All right. Uh, 
Old time strictly dancing ballroom. I wonder if I actually got a hundred in here. Probably. The world's greatest classics. Never gonna get through all these. Faith Hill Breathe. The cores. Talking Corners. I've seen this one before. I think I might have at one point thought about picking it up. Looks a little water damage on the label. CD's fine. The Jazz Collection Collector Edition, Nat King Cole. Another Jazz Collector Edition, Nat King Cole. This is Volume 3. The other one is Volume 1. Classic Instrumentals. I have a feeling it's going to be mostly a lot of that stuff. Well, maybe not. Tina Turner, 24-7. Simple plan. Enrique Iglesias. I, Chantal Kravizuk. I don't know. Sorry about butchering that name. Little Texas Greatest Hits. I think, honestly, this is probably the first one that I actually have. I'm pretty sure I have this. No, actually, I don't I have something else by Little Texas. Uh, Tranquil Moods. Reader's Digest. Healing Our World Guided Healing Meditation with Juni, Jun Yi Lin. GRP All Star Big Band All Blues. NFL Country. Angel du Beau La Pieta. Probably butchered that too. Memphis Mini Crazy Crying Blues. That looks very interesting. Yesterday and Today by Candy Carpenter. Live at Hot, Hot House Cafe, Brenda Carroll and Clairvoyance. Carrie Underwood, Storyteller. And written another Enrique Iglesias, Greatest Hits. Backstreet Boys, Backstreet is Back. Back streets back. Oh, a dollar at Goodwill. Jubilation 3, the Montreal Jubilation Gospel Choir. Z103.5 Summer Rush, the experience too. Well, that's all at first row. Got jewel pieces of you. That's a duplicate. Evanescence Fallen. And this one is a CD-ROM. <laughs> that's hilarious. I saw it, I was like, that looks like a printed case. We got Dixie Checks Fly. Try to go through these a little faster. Diana Crawl stepping out with no 
inserts. Beethoven Symphony Number no. 5. Lara Fabian. Step and Stone, Volume 1. The best bands you have never heard. There you go. Nice close up there. Are there any of those bands, the best bands you've never, have you ever heard any of them? And are they the best bands? Interesting. We'll have to try that one out and see. Dance Mix 96. The Lion King soundtrack. Mm. Spinning Gemini Interval Right. Oh, this is another bicycling one. Tripping Daisy. I am an elastic firecracker. The Friend soundtrack. I'm trying not to spoil any of this by leaving this paper up here, so, but it's not working all that well. Favorite songs of Christmas. Perfect time of the year for that. The hits of Charlie Pride. Join the country club. Siesta Beach. Christmas night. It's kind of hard to see that one. The Ink Spots, My Prayer. City of Angels, which I already do have that one. Piano, Jazz, YTV Big Fun Party Mix 7. Rod Stewart's Greatest Hits. In good shape, too. And then Urban Dance Hits. If nothing else, it certainly is an eclectic mix. Hannah Montana. There's a little bit of everything in here. Music by Jim Belushi and the Sacred Hearts, according to Jim's soundtrack. When the lights come on at Christmas. Put a porter. Looks like soundtrack. I probably said that totally wrong too. I'm not civilized. I'm a freaking red wolf. That's the big band. This one looks like another printed. Ah, it's autographed. Ashley McIsaac. Hi, how are you today? All right. MTV. Karaoke Power Play. The music of Andrew Lloyd Webber. Hollywood Nights, today's movie, biggest movie hits performed instrumentally. Classical Classics.
key fo is this software or is this somebody's photo desk now it looks like it's software Dion yo Frankie Tim Finn before or after the best of Bach Sarah McLaughlin which one is this afterglow I think I just bought this all right we're on to the last row here Billy Ray Cyrus some gave all Awake by Josh Groban. The 20 greatest Christmas songs. Boney M. Okay. Oh, that's good. You two, the Joshua tree. I don't know if I have this or not. I know I have it on vinyl. I don't think I have it on CD. Jeffrey Gaines. Holly, Holly McNarland stuff. In the summertime, greatest hits of the 70s. That's entertainment. 20 great songs from the big screen and Broadway performed by the Film Score Orchestra. You gotta love those. James Last Trumpet A Go Go. Tony Braxton Secrets. What Women Want, the soundtrack. Another Jewel, Spirit. Kelly Clarkson Breakaway. I think the thing's in here backwards, yep. Not sure about the CD. It's a little Pretty beat up. We'll probably still play that. More country heat. Groove Station 7. I'm gonna do these a little faster. Reservoir, Vart, yeah. Reservoir, I can't say it. Diana Ross, best of Diana Ross. Silver Chair, Frog Stomp. Carlene Carter, Little Acts of Treason. Neil Diamond, Hot August Night. A Baroque, a Baroque Messiah. Fisher Price, Little People, Songs and Games for the Road. Billy Clippert, Autographed. Hollywood Soundtracks, Blockbuster Video. Andrea Bocelli Christmas. James Taylor's greatest hits. Have that one. The McNaughton's Vale of Ethel Pipe Band. Live and well. Again.
All right, so I counted them all up, and if I counted correctly, I have 112. And honestly, it's better than I thought it was going to be. They, they said in the description on there that it was going to be a lot of, like, um, names that you knew. You know, it wouldn't be a lot of necessarily a lot of junk, but um, there's definitely things in here. You know, the, the U2 one, the uh, Silver Chair. There, there's a bunch of stuff in here that's pretty good. There's a lot of compilations. Jewel, Backstreet Boys, all these are names that are pretty... No, a tool, um, simple plan. Um, Steely Dam was in there somewhere. Faith Hill. This, I mean, it's not. None of the stuff is like super rare or super like awesome or anything. But it's all you know, good. Friend soundtrack, you know. Um, yeah. So all in all, I don't think it was a bad deal. I thought it was going to be way worse. I thought it was going to be a box full of uh, classical you know compilations and you know stuff like this you know the great broadway show tunes not by the original artists or anything like that i don't have any problem with broadway or that but you know there's just or even the compilations where it's you know not the original artist or anything like that uh performed by the hang out with me band or whatever i've had a few of those over the year but it's it's a really actually a really good mix. So um, I'm gonna go through all of these. Really, I mean, like this is kind of a dud, and those cycling ones. I have no idea what's actually on them, if they're like that thing. And then there's that little people soundtrack. But I mean, hey, that the stuff you don't want. I mean, uh, yeah, and this one too. But I think the good definitely outweighed the bad in this one. So. Definitely not, definitely don't feel ripped off on this one. So, but I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And uh, if you have anything you want me to go over, any mystery boxes that you've seen that you want me to dive in and take a look at, definitely post them below. I'm always open for doing that. Any gizmos or gadgets you've seen around, let me know. Love to check that stuff out. And, uh, other than that, until uh, till the next one, we'll, we'll, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.